the original Spider of the Dragon now. Let's do it. Save slots? I can have a three at once, cool. So we gotta go back to do this eventually and this eventually, but we're gonna do the original Spyro the Dragon game now. Game one, you got a dragon. In the world of dragons. In the world of dragons. In the world of dragons? There we go. Okay, rolling. Uh, oh, uh, it's been peaceful here in the five worlds. Or is it six? <laughs> For a dragon's age, we now have 12,000 treasure. Or is mm. it 14,000? What about this Ganasty Ganok character? Now, I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. I'll take that question. Nasty Nork is a simple creature. Simple? He has been contained in a remote world and is no threat to the Dragon Kingdom. No threat? Besides, he is ugly. Ugly? <laughs> that does it! Like I've got some things to do. Okay, superhero. Classic like superhero line right there. Looks like I've got things to do. Sure do, buddy boy. But if you guys don't know, in this game, the um, Nasty Nork is the main uh, antagonist, and he froze all the dragons in these crystal statues. We got to go around the whole, all the worlds, and uh, free them. So. Oh my god, look at the artisan worlds. Oh, I'm die already, man. There we go. Like I said, guys, I played the, um, the Spiral of the Dragon demo back in the day. I did play the entire Ripto's Rage and Year of the Dragon games, but I never played the entire original Spiral of the Dragon. I only played the demo, so. I played th this home world before. And I played one of the worlds in here called um, uh, Town Square. So I know that uh, I only know that, but uh, yeah, we're gonna learn about this game together. I think. This brings back so many memories. So great, so good. Yeah, remember the uh, original one too, Rachel? Yeah, like I just, like I just said, I never played the original uh, original game from start to finish before. So we will do that together. Let's go free Nestor over here, which I do know this guy's name, so. I know this line too, so. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. What about Nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. Let me fly away. I had the original on a PS3. Oh, for, through a PS3, uh, PSN Classics, uh, Dragon? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I wish they would do that on the PS4, uh, let you play the original games, like they did on the PS3. But, uh, alas, you cannot do that. Dang it. I want to get up there and get these treasures. There we go. Wait, can I not hover in this game? I'm trying to do the hover, but I can't do it here. What the hell? Oh, I got skill pump that. Okay. okay, sure. Okay. love how they updated all the dragons look. All the looks of the rescue dragons. Yeah, they all have like, their, own, their own unique attire in this game, too. Yeah, definitely. Who are you? Delvin? the hell? Where's Nasty Nork? I'll torch him! Keep your horns on, Spyro! You have mm -hmm. much to learn first. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? He's painting him. Uh... His name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. See, like that I've seen before in the original games. I played it in the demo, but just I didn't play the entire game. So, yeah, some of these dragons I, I've seen before, and I can uh, repeat the lines they do. 
Hey, keep your horns on, Spyro. You know what the dragonfly following you is doing? Etc. Etc. Tomas. Hey, Spyro! Press the jump button twice to glide. And and don't be afraid. Afraid of what? Falling from high mountain peaks, plummeting into prehistoric glaciers. Oh, that. Hmm. <laughs> I also love how uh, Tom Kenny's the voice of Spyro in this game. In, in the original game, it was some other voice actor for Spyro. He sounded more like a freaking uh, child rather than like a young teenager. I don't remember the name of the um the original voice actor. I think it was like Carlo something or something like that. I don't know. Over here, boy, give me some gems. If anybody in the chat knows, uh, feel free to speak up. It'll sell this mystery together. Alright, what's in here? Town Square, okay. I'm not gonna do that just yet. I wanna explore a little more around here. It was more childish. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Because yeah, so it really was like, um, in this game back in the day, Spyro was still like a little uh, child dragon. And then Rito's Rage, he became a, like a teenager. With the more uh, deeper and mature voice. Carlos Azurqui. Azurqui? Probably messed up that uh, last name, but he was the voice of Rocco, if you didn't know. This was a Rocco, too? What the hell? I didn't know that, actually. The more you know, Rachel. What the hell? I didn't go in here yet. I think there's some norks in here. This thing. Extra life. What's this? The Stone Hill. Maybe I did play Stone Hill too, and I don't remember it. I don't know. Yeah, I just, I just remember Town Square. I remember uh, this dragon. Cool flash! Do that again! The <laughs> artisan's boss is through a portal in the dragon mouth, but you are not yet ready, Spyro. First, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. Holding a watermelon. Oh, so they, they, I think that's a dragon from the opening cutscene of um, Year of the Dragon in the uh, Reignited version, actually. If you guys remember. The scene where a dragon shoved Hunter down the hole. I think that was the same dragon, actually. Looked like him, at least. Also, Reno 911 as the one with the darker mustache and sunglasses. Oh, yeah, re oh, really? Yeah, I watched Reno 911 for a little bit, actually. Let's go this way. Here's the balloonist. If you prove your worth by rescuing ten dragons, then you may use this balloon to fly to a new world. A new world. I have right now four. Rescue ten dragons. Also, there are eggs in this game too, like in Rear the Dragon. But I don't know if they have a, like a point. Like, if there's a point to them, or they're just like some kind of extra collectible. Like the treasure. And there are egg thieves in this game, too. That's where they came from, actually. Uh, I think we did everything in this uh, area. I think. Let's up here anything. I can't go through that door. That's a world over there, so. Yeah, let's go to the town square, I guess. Why not? Why the hell not, everybody? That's no, not this way. Or which way was it? The doorway over here. Uh, this way? Yeah, and it was, uh... <clears throat> up this tower. I, was, I just saw a treasure I didn't even get yet. I don't know how, but, yeah. the treasure. Cool, cool. And I already 100%ed uh, one level in Spyro. Look at that shit. I already got 100% level completion. My god. Alright, the town square. A whole new world of fantastic point of view. Oh my god. 
Okay, Disney. 